So I think the last, gosh, did Al and Floyd even come out for that one that we had here at Bass Lake on the other side of the lake? I that know of. Was that the one in 2000? Then? It's like 2006 or 2008, 2008 or 2008. 10 or something. I don't know. That's when I just had my surgery. I so. spent most of the time in the bathroom. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I just had my surgery, and Dave was like, whoa, you found out. Well, I know you had the boat. Well, I came up here. Remember that boat? Yeah. So. That Larson. Yeah, that was a good boat. We broke it in Shaver Lake, or Huntington Lake, I think. See, everybody drove that boat more than me did. <laughs> I, I know, I, 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 I took that I boat out, out a bunch of times. I took it out three times, I think. Uh, Gina's friends with a hairstylist that actually did the, did her hair for our wedding, and... and uh, we took her and her son, she's a single mom, out and on the lake and... Uh, the broke of the speed. And, and the uh, accelerator uh, literally broke in full acceleration mode and uh, we were just going around. Uh, you know, I, I was like... I mean, that, sh that stuff was all in the warranty. No one tells me this. I took it to the boat place and had it fixed. But... Uh, they, that was that was towards the end of the ownership of the boat, and uh, I, is that I why I let you guys borrow it for the Memorial Day weekend or something? I we like, we took that boat out several times actually. Yeah, I, it was like the last Memorial Day weekend. I think it was uh, great. I but, go uh, well, it's out on the lake, but you guys can kind of repossess it when they drop it off. I remember. Uh, <laughs> I remember. Uh, um, we took. Uh, one of the loan officers and his family out that was uh, working for us back then. Um, we had a real estate brokerage, as most people know, and uh, he he was really great, Al Lopez, and uh, we went out wakeboarding with him. I think that was Shaver, could have been Millerton, but uh, yeah, that boat got around a lot. Yeah, that boat, that boat, that boat was fun. It did not sit idle. I never had time to go out. I was always working. I was like, everybody's using my boat. But I do re recall it. It actually did handle, and it wasn't a crowded day, so I actually just kept it going full throttle. We just went around the lake. <laughs> then I would, when we needed to stop, I would just kill it. There you go. And then I'd fire it up again, and off we went. <laughs> and boy, did we go. <laughs> then I had to change that prop. Yeah, I, I just figured, whatever, let's do this. I don't know. I wasn't very good at riding. I wasn't the best captain. That was a fun boat. Well, I, I did all right today, I think. I've gotten better at piloting the boat, captain of the boat, whatever. I'm not not ever going to be a great boat captain, I guess. But It just takes practice. What are you doing, boy? I sure would have done better than the guy that launched us today. <laughs> <laughs> That was funny. That poor guy. That's all right. You couldn't do any worse. He just like <laughs> looked at me. <laughs> he crashed the boat. I know. I think well, he was I in Liam. training. I go, well, Liam, you want to drive? You couldn't do any worse. And he just stopped and looked at me like. <laughs> that poor guy. I said, don't worry about it, man. But he crashed the boat into another boat. Yeah. I mean, that it. left a mark. I go, why but don't they you own, give more gas, It's dude. a rental boat, like, and they own both both of them. It's the wind. No, I, no what I think, you know what gas. I think it was? I think he backed it out, and it, they give him a nice little shove off, and he's going, and we had a little wind. He yeah, backs but he, out, but he didn't ever lower the prop. Uh, so you go to accelerate, and the prop's not in the water. That's not going to go well. Thank you. You know, I did a long time ago, and uh, I got one of this. Uh, what do you want? 
You know the mouth, mouth inserts, the mouth guards they, they make you custom made by a dentist named Eric Whiff in uh, Santa Barbara. And I used it for a long time and then I stopped using it and Gina's like, well you don't grind your teeth anymore so I don't need it anymore. And there you go. So I just stopped. Yeah, I got one. Of you know, what are you going to do? Well, I'm going to stop this video and restart it with uh, a new question. Yeah.